Question four. This graph shows the temperature in degrees C from 2 a.m. to 3 p.m. on a cold day. 2 a.m. is here, 3 p.m. is here. Let's have a look at what the questions are. How many degrees warmer was it at 3 p.m. than 3 a.m.? Well, 3 a.m. is here. So if we follow it up to the point on the graph, it's this dot here, which is level with minus 5. So at 3 a.m. it was minus 5 degrees C. And at 3 p.m. we need to go to 3 p.m. which is here. And go up to the point on the graph which is this one. And then follow it all the way across to the side. And that is 2 degrees. That's level with 2 degrees. So at 3 p.m. it was 2 degrees C. So now we think about this part of the question how many degrees warmer was it so how many degrees warmer was it from minus five to two well obviously between minus five and two if you imagine the number line you've got a zero so that can help us because from zero to two that's a gap of two and from zero down to minus five that's a gap of five so basically we've got a gap of five plus a gap of two which makes a total gap of 7. 5 plus 2 is 7. So your final answer for that question is 7 degrees. Scrolling down, we can see the next part of the question. At 6pm, the temperature was 4 degrees lower than at 3pm. So 4 degrees lower than at 3pm, and that is 6pm. So let's go back. So... 6 p.m. and it was 4 degrees C lower than 3 p.m. Just write the question there so we don't have to scroll down again. So 3 p.m. was 2 degrees. We've already got that. So we need to go 4 degrees lower. So if you're on 2 degrees, 1 lower would be 1, 2 lower would be 0, 3 lower would be minus 1, 4 lower would be minus 2. So when you drop down 4 degrees from 2 degrees, if you take away 4 from 2, you get to minus 2. So that is going to be our answer. We might even want to plot that on the graph. So 6 p.m. is here, and we're going down to minus 2. So minus 2 is here. Okay. So your line would actually continue down. So let's just write that on the in our answer box answer minus two degrees